Hi, I'm Rose, and I make cute and useful things for D&D. Today, I'm going to give you a tour of my character journal for my gnome druid, Arnold. Arnold is an enthusiastic botanist obsessed with all plants. His mission in life is to learn about and document them all. Inside the front cover here is a wonderful illustration of Arnold, drawn by my husband Niels. On the opposite page are all the essentials, class, name, level, etc. I decorated these pages with some plant stickers and washi tapes that I've collected over the years. This is Arnold's main character sheet. Uh, he's a circle of the moon druid. This is his role-playing page. As you can see from his portrait, he's got big glasses and a huge bushy moustache. Arnold's backpack is quite an involved piece of equipment. It carries all of his camping gear and botanical tools, but also contains a pocket dimension inside which Arnold sleeps and studies. On top of the bag, Arnold has an enchanted mechanical bird that watches for intruders and sends a little electric shock <laughs> to anyone who dares to meddle with the bag. The Botanomicon is an important part of Arnold's belongings. It's where he documents every single plant he encounters. His dream is to create the world's most comprehensive botanical encyclopedia single-handedly. This is Arnold's inventory. The little list on the left here was from a recent diving expedition where Arnold disguised himself as an octopus and could only carry a few select items in a small sack with him. These are all of the magical items, potions and scrolls that Arnold has collected. His communication station comes in handy for sending messages far and wide. Arnold's spell sheet has a lot going on. I copied the list of druid spells into the spaces so it's easy to choose which ones to prepare each day. Here is where I document Arnold's most used wild shapes. I filled in the creature stat blocks for a bear and a cat, as these are the forms that he most commonly takes. As you can see, every wild shape that Arnold becomes always has a moustache in some form or another. <laughs> Onto the blank part of the journal, I was excited to use this as a space for how Arnold's Botanomicon could look. In our campaign, we explored a lot of swamp and jungle land, and I'd choose various plant stickers as inspiration to come up with the sorts of flora we'd encounter. Arnold often makes good berry broth for everyone when resting. Whilst in the jungle, we came across a lot of strange, magical flowers surrounded by fey creatures. Here are some herbs Arnold found in the marshlands. Swamp sage is his favourite to use when cooking. Stink lilies were quite an unpleasant find in the box. It's also been fun to concoct medicines and potions from the herbs that he finds. Sprignog was a festive concoction of Arnold's own making. Here I also made a small map of the swamp and the various places to find potion shops and apothecaries. This is a little bit about a secret succulent garden that he found. Here I drew the inside of the pocket dimension contained in Arnold's backpack. A cosy bed is tucked amongst bookshelves, desks and many, many plant samples. The last time I played Arnold, we headed into space, and so I began to chart some of the intergalactic flora that he encountered. For now though, that's it for Arnold until the next time I play him. I hope you enjoyed taking a peek at his journal. I'll link the journal and such down below, and if you want to see more of the things I make, follow me on Instagram, I'll add the link for that below too. Thanks for watching.